Our guest today, folks, is Shannon Prosite. Shannon is a business strategist, marketing consultant. Uh, she's spent 10 years building international uh, consciousness in the business community, focusing on helping small business grow through education, marketing, strategy, planning, and public relations. Her website, folks, is shannonprosites.com, and that's spelled S-H-A-N-N-O-N-P-R-O-C-I-S-E.com. See that, Shannon? You got free marketing already. Thank you. How you doing? I'm doing wonderful. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. And the reason I'm saying that, folks, if you're watching Tiger TV, what you're going to end up seeing, you're going to see Media Magic. And inside Media Magic, there it is. And there is, uh, let's see, Media Magic details the entire process of getting your publicity everywhere for free. I love it. So tell us exactly what you do and tell you get plenty of people out here, you know, that have small businesses and they'd all like to make more money and, you know, get more business. Wonderful, thank you for asking. Yes, um, through my journey of producing over 400 events, um, I had to learn about marketing. So not only have I learned how to build community, create raving fans and have an impact through events, but also learn the power of publicity and, and how you can go out and create a story that becomes a magnet for not only customers, but for the media to tell your story for you. Sure, and what type of events have you done? Oh my gosh, so we our signature event has been the Business Acceleration Summit. Uh, that's where we bring in very high level attorneys, uh, marketing strategists. Um, we've had lots of people from all over the globe that come and brain tie. Okay. And so we have businesses that will come and break bread and, and be able to ask questions as we mastermind with these experts on, on moving their project or their, their business forward. And what do you find, Shannon, that, that folks need the most in business? Uh, they need more community. They need to be able to ask for help. Um, they need to be willing. You, you said, I don't know if you said one, but I can give you a few things. Um, you know, really being okay with, with being vulnerable and, and saying, hey, you know, how can, how can I get support with this? So I see a lot of people that are being solopreneurs or trying to do things on their, on their own or, or um, you know, really maybe not surrounding themselves with mentors. So if I was to say one thing, it'd be surrounding yourself with people that are doing what you've done or want to do and willing to, um, to help you along the way. Yeah, that, that's a huge one. There's no doubt. When you're, all, when you're talking the same language in the same business, it's a whole different ball game. You know, there's, there's no doubt about that. W the different businesses that you work with, I'm sure that you see a lot of different businesses. What types of businesses do you think right now would be a good business for people to get into? Oh, well, you, you were talking in the commercial just before this a little bit about investing. Um, I think right now anything that will um, help a business with some of the economic shift that's happening right now. Um, I also work with an organization that's helping people um, get their, their house in order, meaning their financial house in order. Um, I think anything to help people pivot to go online. I think a lot of people are doing the pivot, but they're still trying to shift their business to be um, more online and, and attracting customers that way. So anything to help people um, make this pivot with success and ease and grace um, is a, you know, is a winner. And sure. Bitcoin and so that, crypto, that's, I think that's another thing that people are, you know, it's going crazy right now. And what is, I'm sorry, what, what was the last? Bitcoin and cryptocurrency, and that's a whole other thing. That's sure. Going crazy right I guess I, I'm, I'm surprised that um, you're saying that the aspect that people don't understand about going online. I mean, it's 2021 now. I, I, I know, uh, but this is this is a you know for example I have a friend who's run a salon here for 50 years. Sure. And she has all of these hairdressers. Well, she never even thought of how do we sell products online? How do we set up our um, stylists so that they have ongoing income even if they you know they don't have the same customers? So there's a lot of brick and mortar businesses where they're having to look at how do I go online? There's a lot of people that have been online, but you know maybe they need to do more automation and. Um, and maybe their business, a lot of businesses are, are booming right now that are online and they're, they're having to um, manage that growth and manage the, the customers in a different way. Yeah, that's so intriguing because my better half owns an Aveda salon. And uh, if, you don't, if you're not on Instagram, folks, okay, you don't have any business, period, in the salon business. So that, that's, that's, well, that, that's eye-opening. There's no doubt about that. The, when, when folks basically, well, when you do these workshops, right, 
Are they paid workshop? Is that how it works? You paid workshop and then you pay people that, that are coming in to speak? Is that how it works? Um, no, I have a completely different model. Um, it is people do pay to attend if they want the meals. We do a lot of scholarships and sponsor, you know, individuals to attend. Okay. Um, but uh, most of the individuals that, that are there are there because they they want to be a part of making an impact. And, um, and it's their way of prospecting. So we don't pay any of the speakers and we've attracted some really big names. They just believe in our mission and vision of, of helping other businesses grow and then also some of the give back that, that we do. Yeah, sure, that would make sense. So the, you, you get the business in there, they're, they're in there giving good ideas and simultaneously pitching their own business, right? Yeah, in our in ours, they're not allowed to pitch, but naturally, as you know, when you sure, help right, somebody right. and you give, it's right. like no, which is cool, right? Know, exactly. Yeah. No, there, there, there's no doubt about that. There's there's no. And so the uh, what else is in media magic that we should know? Oh boy! So in media magic, um, there's all of these templates on how to write a press release that stands out. Okay. Um, there's also everything to creating a press kit, how to write a power bio. There's a hundred of the most powerful words in the English language that I we encourage people to use with their their power bio. We focus. Um, quite a bit on that bio because we find that it's the hardest thing for people to do is to talk about themselves, but yet it's the one thing that when we have that, we can attract higher paying clients and speaking gigs and more yeses on proposals. Yeah, that hundred words is pretty cool. I like that. You know what's amazing about the, uh, you know, the PR business in general, that, you know, it, it, you, you probably know this, but Warren Buffett owns the largest, you know, the, the the PR Newswire. And folks, this PR Newswire is such a joke, it's unbelievable. But guess what? Everyone pays for it. It's like, it's like I mean, I, I, get, I better get a thousand of them every day. And it's like, it, it blows my mind that, uh, but, but guess what? Public companies have to pay for it. Like when I'm selling advertising, I'm always saying to them, why are you putting that out there? Because no one's reading it, you know? So it's just, it, it, it's amazing to me in general, you know? So I guess when, when folks are putting it out, you, you want to basically focus to basically the market they're in probably, right? Well, yeah, and, and I really, um, I find that if somebody's talking about you, you can get bigger articles. So this, this yeah. style is really designed to get them to, to want to know, know more. Um, because when they're telling a story about you, there there's always 100% an inaccuracy I found, but at least they, they tend to give you more space. They tend to um, dive a little bit deeper and they will actually sell you if they're the one doing the interview. Anytime mm -hmm. you pay for it, and I, I do some great syndication work also, yeah. um, it's just a different animal than, than, a, than, than somebody wanting no, to it, write or share the story. There, there's no doubt. It's, it's in, in what she's saying specifically, folks, is that you have one writer that does it, then you're going to use that to get the next one, to get the next one, to get the I've done it. I, I know what you're saying, and, and that works. There's no doubt about it. Shannon, this has been a pleasure. You have a great one, safe one. And uh, her website, folks, is Shannon Procise. That's S-H-A-N-N-O-N-P-R-O-C-I-S-E.com. Have a great one. Have a safe one. We look forward to having you on again. Thank you so much, Brian. Thank you. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. We have the Dow Industrials right now. We're at, it's all green. The Dow's up 116. The Nasdaq is up 162. S&Ps are up 30. To the moon, Alice. To the moon. Come on right back.